the chef Brandon Hurst white yeah anyways <laughs> and is not prepared for tonight's endeavors no welcome to cooking with it with it do you like to tell them what you don't have out of this batch we don't have almond milk so we're using water um we don't have vegetable oil so we're using peanut oil we don't have baking soda so we're using baking powder we don't have kosher salt so we're using salt we have old sugar we have it old flour and berries in which they don't suggest. Let's do this. But we did manage to score this, which is coffee house icing. Tastes exactly like coffee. So at least something will cover the taste. Diabetes. Diabetes. on the oil. I'm focusing on my hard stirring work being destroyed by these. Just listen to the sound of winners. It sounds like a beach area. The glistening putty. <laughs> so the reason for that madness is because he forgot to include the oil when I was stirring the first time. Mm-hmm. Now as you can hear it, it sounds goopy. To say the least. Disgusting. You guys asked me for an ASMR video. <laughs> Taking a break to show you how cool this countertop actually is. Oh my god. Oh my god. It's like a rave cooking party, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah! Yeah. On the more positive note, but the, I don't know how much more positive you can get besides this fucking countertop. But we've got Halloween muffins, and it's August. It's August. <laughs> it's his birthday. It is actually Ed's birthday today, and we are making muffins because we're fly like that, and we all like Halloween. So when you're done putting the souls of your enemies into the trays, you are going to then put them in your already preheated oven and then watch as they melt and burn away into the crisp little muffins that they are. And then you can devour their souls for a second time. Thank you.